Welcome, Pisces. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for January 6, 2024, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. It is essential to remember that as multidimensional beings, our sensitivity allows us to capture energies from other dimensions. This gift can manifest itself through intuition, clairvoyance, or the ability to sense presences around us. The entities we perceive are not to be feared, they are guides, angels and higher beings that surround us to provide us with constant support and love. Focusing on your desires to improve your financial income, it is important to recognize that money does not only mean acquiring material goods. It is also linked to general health and well-being. By seeking a deeper connection with yourself, you will move closer to your true self, allowing abundance to flow naturally into your life. The key to achieving your goals lies in connecting with your intuition and your higher self. This process does not involve excessive efforts, but rather waking up early, exercising and meditating. By clearing your energy and silencing your mind, you can receive the guidance you need to move toward the life you long for. The angel's message highlights the importance of spending time outdoors to recharge energetically. Breathe in the fresh air, let nature surround you, and open your windows to refresh your home. These simple acts will connect you more deeply with yourself and the universe. At this time, it is normal to feel some indecision about the path to follow. However, by freeing yourself from the limitations of your mind, you will be able to access an inner clarity that will show you the right path. Visualize your ideal life, the one that inspires you, and allow this vision to guide your daily actions. You should feel comfortable breaking down old structures or boundaries in order to establish new ones, dear Pisces, as the Libra Moon and Venus collaborate overhead. Now is also a good time to bring order to your goals around transformation and empowerment. You'll connect with others easily as the hours unfold, putting you in a compassionate mood that supports intimate exchanges. Just be mindful of who you tell your secrets to as the quarter moon rises this evening, confiding in only those you know you can trust. Look for ways to ground and release stress as the day comes to a close and Chiron activates. You can speculate easily what is about to happen. And you have an expressive attitude with impressive communication skills. So just strive hard for what you want. Refrain yourself from getting into any altercations with aggressive people who are always fault-finding. People please are alert. Today, your ruler, sacrificial Neptune, locks horns with the moon, making you prone to bending over so far backward that you need a chiropractor. Being generous is one thing, but losing your voice to make another person happy? Bad idea. You'll only end up resentful later on. If your SO, best friend or business partner is not pulling their weight, call them on the carpet. They won't get the hint that you need help just because you're giving what you'd like to receive in return. Early today, part of you wants to state your case, and another part would prefer to let things go, dear Pisces. With a Venus-Jupiter minor challenging aspect, a career, public, life direction, or reputation matter could throw you a little off-center temporarily. Promises made now may not transpire. You might attract people to you who take you for granted, and you may need to establish boundaries as a result. If you feel slightly out of balance, your best bet is to slow down and avoid acting on impulses. Some procrastination or uncertainty about your next step is possible. The day advances with a stronger feeling of purpose that energizes you. You're focusing on layers of meaning and understanding. You're likely to notice elements of people and situations that you may have missed or seemed hidden to you previously. Remember, Pisces, that you are an extraordinary being and you deserve to live a full life. Follow this path of self-care spiritual connection and conscious decision making abundance awaits you and it all starts with reconnecting with your higher self and trusting the process we send you love and light on your journey 
Today's tarot reading for your sign. Four of Swords, this card suggests a period of reflection and waiting, possibly related to past disappointment in the emotional realm. It may indicate the need to take some time before addressing sentimental situations. Queen of Cups, your predominant energy today is that of the Queen of Cups, reflecting unconditional love and acceptance. It is a reminder to embrace compassion and empathy, both with yourself and with others. Your ability to understand and forgive will be key. Aquarius card, this card highlights a strong, divine connection, possibly with someone close. It may indicate similarities in shared beliefs or experiences. Pay attention to the signals and synchronicities that may arise in your interactions. Knight of Swords, today, you are likely to face a direct and possibly challenging conversation. The energy of this knight suggests the need to express your thoughts and feelings clearly, although it can be a bit abrasive. Eight of Wands, the presence of the Eight of Wands signals a day full of activity and communication. Many conversations or quick news may arise. Stay calm and try to organize your thoughts to avoid feeling overwhelmed. The day for Pisces seems to be marked by the duality of energies. On the one hand, the Four of Swords suggests the need to take time to reflect before addressing emotional situations. There may be a feeling of waiting related to past events. However, the strong presence of the Queen of Cups indicates that your ability to embrace unconditional love and acceptance will be essential. It is a reminder not to hold on to resentments and instead embrace compassion. The Aquarius card highlights meaningful connections, whether with friends, family, or even romantic relationships. Look for similarities and find common points that strengthen those ties. The Knight of Swords warns of a frank conversation that may arise. Although it may be challenging, it is essential to express your thoughts clearly and honestly, maintaining integrity in communications. The Eight of Wands indicates a constant flow of information and activity. Stay calm and organize your ideas to make the most of this dynamic day. In short, today offers the opportunity to heal emotional wounds through compassion, strengthen meaningful connections, and face important conversations with honesty and clarity. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. This is an excellent day for communication so take time today to discuss financial ideas and plans with others. This moon means you have no time for small talk and you are not interested in half-baked ideas which have no grounding in reality. However, be mindful of how you respond to the ideas or opinions of others. You may find validity and even the opportunity to build on others' ideas, even if they do not seem immediately or obviously grounded. You may find a new investment or venture looking favorable in the coming future so go with your intuition today. What is it trying to tell you? The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for January 6 are 12, 34, 10, 8, 51, 27. Daily love. You've been cranking right along in recent weeks, Pisces. This is because mighty Mars, the red planet of passion and energy, has been in your solar 10th house of achievement and will spin here for one more day. On the one hand, this could shift your priorities away from your personal and romantic life significantly and make it harder for singles to meet someone new if they're constantly on the grind. Couples may feel friction, too, if you're burning the candle at both ends but not making quality, intimate time. Be sure you have your cap on right as you venture into this newfound period. The moon is in Libra and in your 8th house of committed partnerships, but it is also squaring Venus in your 10th house. Having a common project that you'll work towards with your romantic partner generally creates a much healthier and successful relationship dynamic. This is because this allows you to pursue something that calls you and not feeling like it is at odds with your romantic life but rather complements it. This also gives you something to connect with your partner through. So many relationships don't succeed because the people involved don't feel like they can relate to their partner on a bigger level, 
one that extends outside of the personal relationship. At work. People engaged in teaching, writing, journalism and literature are going to enjoy huge success in their career today and you may be honored for your achievements. The day is also suitable for investment in educational institutions and in construction business. In general, you are going to enjoy a quiet day at work a relief from the rush of the past few days. What's the nature of your partnerships with those whom you work with? Are you skillful in forming and maintaining those relationships? These are questions to reflect on as the moon is in Libra and in your eighth house of business partnerships. Check in with yourself and see if you have the ability to easily work alongside others. A big part of what determines the success of those relations is the ability for both parties to compromise and have the willingness to hear one another out. Ask yourself if you tend to be the kind of person who prefers to work alone all the time, if that's the case, how can you learn to involve others in your work process? The moon is squaring Venus in your 10th house, reminding you that you need other people's help to achieve what you wish to in your career. Health. It seems to be a bit difficult for you to realize healthy habits. Maybe your stubborn nature is getting you fixed and stagnating your progress. Put your health first. Be stubborn when it comes to taking proper rest before each night, going to gym every morning and consuming balanced meals. During this transit, Pisces should focus on their emotional well-being. Take time for self-care, like meditation or journaling, to help process your emotions. Moonstone is a helpful crystal for Pisces, promoting emotional healing and intuition. Incorporating nourishing foods, like soups or stews, can also be beneficial for overall health. Family and friends. Nobody has the permission to make you feel down. It is a trying time. If your love hurts, it was never meant to be yours. It is time to move on. There is no social obligation to remain attached with something that does not gel with your energies. With clashing energies, it is better to back off. You may find love shortly. People could surprise you, but it looks like you'll rather enjoy the experience, especially if you take the opportunity to form a dynamic duo with someone special along the way. The intuitive moon spends the day moving through Libra and your eighth house of romantic partnerships, and while she is there she will take the opportunity to reach out across the sky and form a positive angle with rebellious Uranus in Taurus. Uranus is currently in your social sector, so an invitation could come winging its way out of the blue and provide you with the perfect opportunity to woo your next potential bedroom buddy. Coupled Pisces will enjoy mixing things up, so even if you're a certified home buddy you should still take this opportunity to get out there and paint the town red because a little shake-up is a good thing. Compatibility. At work Leo. In love Libra. In luck Virgo. Your lucky color today. Emerald. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.